Stephanie Colbert tonight. I just tell my boyfriend of the night. But police say she confessed to murder. <laughs> One big problem. You can't hear it. How do you mess up the confession? What will a jury believe? 48 Hours, Wednesday at 10, 9 Central on CBS. A flawed back-to-school plan. The charges teachers from the state line's two largest school districts are making against Winnebago County's top health official after comments she made that some union leaders took offense to. COVID has canceled almost every major summer event in 2020, but it can't dampen the holiday spirit of one of the biggest state line celebrations to get us ready for winter. How you can help spread some Christmas cheer. Working for you. This is the 23 News Update at 10. After the Winnebago County Health Department administrator made comments about the role teachers play in the spread of COVID-19 at schools, the Rockford Education Association writes a letter speaking out in support of its colleagues. In her remarks on Monday, Dr. Sandra Martell said the school super spreaders or those who are a source of viral infection are an average of 26 years old. While Dr. Martell acknowledges that the 69 cases across schools is an even split among faculty and students. REA President Mel Gilfillan says her choice of words places unnecessary blame on the hardworking teachers. You know, our RPS uh, teachers and our REA members are doing everything that they can, um, uh, you know, during this tough time to do uh, the best that they can and keep everybody, including themselves, safe. So far, 33 adults and 36 children have tested positive for COVID-19 since the start of the school year. Another state line school dic uh, district is peeking out in disapproval of Dr. Martell's comments. 23 News reporter Kristen Camilleri explains the concerns teachers in the Harlem School District have with the county's top health official. Mike Shannon, the Harlem Federation of Teachers say they stand with the REA and call out the Winnebago County Health Department saying they are disappointed in Dr. Martell's stance towards educators in light of the pandemic and they want to feel like they're a top priority. Now the school personnel, I'm going to call them the adult kiddos, have not been following the guidance consistence. Winnebago County Public Health Administrator Dr. Sandra Martell is under fire for comments she made suggesting teachers are responsible for many of the COVID-19 cases within area schools. 